Jerusalem's old city erupts with another round of clashes. This footage, captured by Al Jazeera's producer, shows Palestinians throwing rocks as Israeli police fire tear gas, rubber bullets and stun grenades at protesters on the Haram al-Sharif Temple Mount. The clashes broke out just after Friday prayers as Palestinian worshippers gathered at the Aqsa compound to protest what they see as Israel's attempts to lay claim to sacred Islamic sites. Israeli police say they moved into the compound when they received reports that stones were being thrown at the Western Wall, one of Judaism's holiest sites which borders the Aqsa Mosque. They insist they dealt with the matter using the minimum force possible. Anyone who breaks the law, both uh, in uh, East Jerusalem, West Jerusalem, there's no differentiation. As far as we're concerned, as soon as there's riots, which are in fact incited by a small minority of youngsters, we will immediately deal with those disturbances. The clashes saw many Palestinians injured, some seriously as a result of rubber bullet fire. Worshippers locked inside the compound when the gates were sealed by the police begged to be let out as the violence erupted. A decision to list shrines in the West Bank as part of Israel's national heritage has ignited the Palestinian street. The Haram al-Sharif is a sacred Jewish and Muslim site and is often a flashpoint for violence. Palestinian leaders across the political divide as well as Arab officials have called on Israel to stop its provocations before a religious war erupts. Religious tensions have been rising these past weeks as Palestinians claim Israel is attacking their holy sites. Friday's clashes are the latest in a round of confrontations between Israeli police and Palestinians. They're unlikely to be the last. Shireen Tadros, Al Jazeera, Jerusalem.